Sultan is first crossed and they carried 30 days for an 11-day voyage worth of food and the fresh meat would last until for the first three days and then they'd go on to salted and preserved meat fish and their dry goods as well. Fresh milk was plentiful because they had a, a live cow slung on the deck in a hammock and uh, but towards the end of the crossing fresh beef was back on the menu. They had live chickens on board for their fresh eggs and because there's no refrigeration back in those days and everything used to be kept on the top decks in ice chests. Of course nowadays it's totally different. Refrigeration is the biggest key obviously. For standard seven day crossing for us on here we're loading about 120 tonnes of food every voyage. So compared to the one cow and beef at the end of the voyage we've got beef for the whole seven days. On that 120 tonnes, it's broken down into about 40 tonnes of fresh fruit and vegetables, plus all the meats, and the rest will be dry stores. So, you know, we're pretty much switched on to exactly seven day crossing, seven days worth of food, and then we reload again. But generally, nowadays, refrigeration is the key, which unfortunately they didn't.